calculation involving unit cell dimensions. We can determine the edge length of a unit cell by X-ray diffraction. We can also calculate the number of atoms per unit cell from the knowledge of the type of lattice. By using these values, we can calculate the density of the solid. Let A be edge length of the unit cell and Z be the number of atoms per unit cell and M be the mass of an atom. Then, volume of the cubic unit cell is equal to A cube and mass of the unit cell is equal to number of atoms per unit cell into mass of an atom. Mass of the unit cell is equal to Z into M. If M is the molar mass of the element, then mass of one atom, M, mass of each atom is equal to molar mass M by Avogadro's number Na. Since density of the material is equal to density of the unit cell, density of the unit cell is equal to mass of the unit cell by volume of the unit cell. Density of the unit cell is equal to Zm by A cube. Now substitute M where M is equal to M by Na. Therefore, density of the unit cell D is equal to Zm by Na A cube where A is expressed in centimeters, M in grams per mole and D in grams per cubic centimeter. The density of the substance is the same as the density of the unit cell.